getting uh, to see a lot of different cities, uh, a lot of different architecture, uh, a beautiful venue like this that has uh, all this history behind it. Um, it's, it's, it's very interesting to see these, these buildings uh, that have been around for a hundred or so years. You know, it's, it's good to be out here every day doing, doing what it is you love to do. So that, that part's great about being out here, being with an artist who's really spent a lot of time perfecting his craft and is just a brilliant songwriter. The best is the traveling. The worst is, ironically, not being home. It's an interesting thing. It's kind of a love-hate thing because you love being out here and you love getting to play for people and um, you love doing shows every single night. That's a blast. Music and touring as an occupation are, to me, one of the most uh, privileged things that you could do for a living. Um, to be able to share your art with people um, who are there to experience exactly that. The music, what you have to offer, your talents. You know, the connections that you make around wherever you go. I mean, when I toured Canada, um, it's just really neat to know that, you know, you can stop in almost any city that you've toured in and you'll know someone there and you can meet up with someone. I think each town has its own little signature within the province. Sleeping quarters on the bus, it's, uh, it's different not for someone who's uh, claustrophobic in any way. Um, it's basically about the size of a, if you can imagine sleeping in a coffin, a few hours a night. It's about that size. Um, but it does have a DVD player, so. I guess one of the things that I love the most about it and I sometimes find the most difficult is that the one thing that you can count on always being the same is that every single day you get up, everything's going to completely change. and so. Uh, um, you just really never know what's going to happen, and um, that can be that can be kind of fun sometimes. And sometimes it's like, I just want to know what's going to happen today, please. That'd be kind of nice. Sometimes you, you get kind of tired, late, lots of late nights. Just waiting for Murphy to come flying out of one of these little uh, theaters and uh, go, "Hey, Bob, I'm here," and uh, then I go to work. I like this uh, rock and roll in the Hamburg, Germany. <laughs> <laughs>